you guys know the meme where the kid goes, Mom, can we get so-and-so? And the mom goes, No, we have so-and-so at home. That is the equivalent of old Survivor and new era Survivor. So I'm going to go through and rank these six war crimes committed against the Survivor community. But before that, me and my friends did a Survivor season for a dollar. It was the most fun video I've ever made in my entire life. And it would mean a lot to me and the cast if you guys would go watch that and comment down below your opinions on it. But yeah, let's get into the video. By far, the worst new era season is 41, and it isn't even close. I'm not gonna lie, I stopped watching this season at like four episodes in because all of the interesting players get voted out back to back to back to back to back to back to back in a row. And come merge, everyone is either bland annoying or they're just stupid i got a hot take i don't care that xander didn't win because i don't care about xander bro is boring the only players i'd want to see come back from this season are jd and brad and heather oh heather how i despise you how are you going to come on to survivor and besmirch the name of one of the best players in total drama history shame on you heather Shame on you. And I'm not going to sit and say that Erica was a bad winner because I didn't watch the full season. But from what I did see, she was very boring. Okay, now that I'm done talking about that flaming pile of dog poop, let's talk about another one. The second worst new era season is Survivor 46. And I know people in the comments will be like, what are you talking about? Oh, this is the best season ever because it's... But in reality, it's just that your little caveman brain cannot comprehend that new does not equal good. The pre-merge was absolutely atrocious because of Bahanu Gabal, and we only have like around actually two good episodes of the season. Because after the Split Tribal episode, we are forced to watch every single interesting and entertaining player go out back to back to back to back to back to back. It is actually infuriating that we got the final five we did, considering how many entertaining people there actually were on the season. Like having Ben and Liz in the final five is very funny, but also annoying. Also, I'm not ranking these as just seasons by themselves. I'm factoring in all of the other stuff to go with it. And oh boy, this cast has been the whiniest thing I've ever seen in my entire life on Twitter. And it seems there's really only one person who is the root cause for this chaos. And that is Venus the Stinkus. Never have my entire in my entire life have I seen somebody with this much of a victim complex. She's rude to everybody in her tribe and on the entire cast that she has talked to, but then gets sad when people are also rude to her back. That's crazy. The third worst new era season in Survivor is Survivor 42. And despite this not being the worst season, it still has the single most annoying piece of fiction I have seen in my entire life. That's being the Drea and Mary Ann Tribal Council, where they talk about it's racist to vote out black people, even though they're the reason one of the black people was voted out, but we're not going to talk about that. And also, apparently some stuff has come out about Ponderosa, and Drea is not a good person. <laughs> Who could have guessed? Yeah, but anytime I think about Survivor 42, I just kind of get depressed, but then I remember that Jonathan exists and get happy again. Listen to me. Anyone saying that they don't like Jonathan is a moronic bozo buffoon, and is just saying that because he's a straight white male, and that's their only reason for disliking him. Yeah, but that's about all there is to say about Survivor 42. I guess the winner was okay. I don't really care about any of the final three, to be honest. The fourth least horrible season of the new era is Survivor 44. Now, if someone asked me if I would rather watch 44 again, or go watch Paint Dry... The paint's looking pretty appealing to me. 44 is so unbearably boring. You pretty much know who's going to go home post-merge every single episode before the five minute mark. It gave birth to the most cringy showmance in the entire history of Survivor with Matt and Franny. Honestly, there is not a single person in this cast I would want to see return for another season. Wait, that's actually not true. The Matthew who almost died, he's kind of cool actually. And this season also tried to kill Brucey Brucey, which is absolutely unforgivable. 
Well, there is literally nothing else to say about that garbage season. The second least garbage season of the new era is Survivor 45. And this season actually has a lot of things going for it. Like, it has the best Survivor player to ever exist in Bruce. And also has the best nerd archetype of the new era with Drewster. And despite the two absolute bozo quitters, it was still a pretty good pre-merge. My only issue with this season is that the winner of the season is an absolutely horrible person, which is very annoying that the worst person in the cast won the money. And there are still some brain dead people that don't think that Dee did anything wrong. If you think that, you're an actual stupid person. And the least worst season of the new era without a shadow of a doubt is Survivor 43. Now, I could give you a list of reasons as to why this season is better than all the rest, but honestly, I don't need to, because Mike Gabler beating Cassidy already puts it above the rest. Well guys, that's gonna be the end of this video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to hit that like button, and if you hate Cassidy, make sure to subscribe. Well guys, that's gonna be the end of this video, and I will see you all next time. Yee. Hey everybody, this is Bruce here for Season 45 Survivor. Now I, Bruce, the greatest Survivor player to ever exist, the man that all of you subscribe to Meme View. Uh, that's M-E-M-E -E, View. Um, and hit the like button. Or, if you don't, you end up like me on Season 44. Alright? You don't want that? Do ya! Ah, peace! <laughs>